Today, we're going to be looking at a very beautiful landmark in the United Arab Emirates. Today's landmark is the Museum of the Future. The Museum of the Future is an exhibition space for innovative and futuristic ideologies, services and products located in the financial district of Dubai, UAE. It was inaugurated by His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Vice President and Prime Minister of the United Arab Emirates and the ruler of Dubai, on February the 22nd, 2022. The choice of the date was officially made as it is a palindrome date. The goal of this museum is to promote technological development and innovation, especially in the fields of robotics and artificial intelligence. On the 7th of February 2016, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid inaugurated the Museum of the Future exhibition as part of the World Government Summit. On the 24th of April 2016, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed launched the Dubai Future Foundation. Under the new structure, the Museum of the Future became a part of the Dubai Future Foundation. The museum has held many exhibitions of the World Government Summit over the years as its building was taking shape. The museum will host innovation labs dedicated to several sectors, including health, education, smart cities, energy, and transport. It will also support and test new inventions in partnership with research institutes and universities. One of Dubai's most famous landmarks, the Museum of the Future takes pride of place along the city's superhighway. Sheikh Zayed Road. The museum explores how society could evolve in the coming decades using science and technology. Termed as a living museum, it incorporates elements of traditional exhibitions, immersive theatre and themed attractions, so visitors can look beyond the present and towards the future's limitless possibilities. Furthering a global intellectual movement, it's also the headquarters for the city's Great Arab Minds Initiative that aims to identify 1,000 exceptional Arab talents across key fields. The museum has seven floors dedicated to different exhibitions. Three floors focus on outer space resource development, ecosystems and bioengineering, as well as health and well-being. The other floors showcase near-future technologies that address challenges in areas including health, water, food, transportation and energy, while the last floor is dedicated to children. Visitors will have the chance to engage with next generation solutions. Each floor of the museum is designed like an expansive interactive movie set, brought to life by expert storytellers, technologists and visionary artists. Topics and focus include the future of space travel and living, climate change and ecology, health, wellness, and spirituality. Aside from groundbreaking innovations, there will also be special workshops and talks from the world's greatest minds. Children aged 3 to 10 can enjoy an open-world experience at the Future Heroes environment, a dedicated area designed to encourage little ones to tap into their potential. Designed as an asymmetric torus, Clad in steel and glass, the Museum of the Future has been recognized by National Geographic as one of the 14 most beautiful museums in the world. It was designed by Keeler Design Architecture Studio and was engineered by Bureau Hapholt. The Museum of the Future is 77 meters or 225 feet tall and occupies an overall area capacity of 30,548 square meters. The museum is not only a visual and artistic beacon, but also sets new innovative benchmarks. As a 17,000 meter square torus shaped building clad in stainless steel, it achieves lead platinum status in terms of its green rating. The Museum of the Future is comprised of three main parts, the Green Hill, the building and the void. The green hill represents the earth with solidity, permanence and rootedness in place, time 
in history. This is done through the smooth transition from the site, in the form of an earthen, vegetated mound, with minimal visible built intervention. The inspiration for the green hill was also to elevate the building in a calm and unobtrusive way above the metro line and create greenery in elevation that is uncommon in Dubai, where visitors can enjoy while engaging with the museum. Likewise, the glimmering, futuristic upper building represents mankind with all of its strength, artistry and ability to create in harmony with its surroundings. This is formed by the bold shape which emerges from the hill, covered with the Arabic calligraphy about the future and displaying mankind's passion for the arts and creating. Lastly, the elliptical void within the upper structure represents innovation. This is done primarily by creating an empty space showing the unwritten future into which humanity and the world can symbolically look towards. This open and unburdened future is an inspiration which can drive the innovators and creators of today. The museum's striking exterior also stands out thanks to its artistic use of Arabic calligraphy, which also functions as glass windows. This torus-shaped shell sits on top of the building and comprises 1024 fire retardant composite panels clad in stainless steel, and each of which has a unique 3D shape to create the Arabic script. Designed by Emirati artist Matar bin Lahij, they reflect lines of inspirational poetry by His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vice President and Prime Minister of the UAE and the ruler of Dubai. The lines are as follows. We won't live for hundreds of years, but we can create something that will last for hundreds of years. The future will be for those who will be able to imagine, design and build it. The future does not wait. The future can be designed and built today. The secret of the renewal of life, the development of civilization and the progress of humanity is in one word, innovation. These three lines were the translation of the Arabic poem that is inscribed on the Museum of the Future. The design is a low carbon civic building achieved through the use of many design innovations, which include parametric design, passive solar architecture, low energy and low water engineering solutions, recovery strategies for both energy and water, and building integrated renewables. The 78 meter high building accommodates six exhibition and one administration floors, above a three-story podium and a food and beverage deck, with an auditorium, retail spaces, parking spaces, as well as services. The building is easily accessible on foot, as it's connected to many of the rideshare services. It's also connected to the city's Red Line Metro service. Visitors can disembark at Emirates Towers Metro Station and use the footbridge to enter the museum directly. The museum is open between 10 a.m. and 6 p.m. local time, with 15 guided tour slots throughout this time. Each tour takes approximately two to three hours. The Museum of the Future is truly an exciting sight to see and it represents the innovative spirit of the city. It is, in fact, a true architectural marvel and an incubator for ideas.